Right guys, next up is a decline dumbbell press. So decline basically means our head is lower than our legs. So on this bench here, it's gonna be simply taking that out and placing it down. As you can see, it goes down on a nice angle. If you don't have a decline bench, then keep your bench flat and put some weight under the seat side. So as if you are gonna keep your head lower than what your, your legs are. But that's a perfect angle for a decline and we're gonna do this with a dumbbell and Ashley's gonna be doing this one. So we're gonna take a dumbbell. Now, decline is generally where people are strongest. It's our strongest part of our chest. So she's gonna place them onto her knees. Now, one thing you've got to do when you go down a decline is lower yourself down very carefully because you could slide down the bench. So perfect position on this. She's in, a, she's in the right position. So Ashley's now gonna just start pressing up the sky. Now the form is paramount on this. So when she's getting to the top, she's holding the pause for a split second, squeezing and taking it down. And again, whenever we're doing our chest exercises, we're imagining that there's a bar which is going across there. So as that bar comes down, it hits a chest and it goes back up. So we don't take it too far down because otherwise it'll engage our shoulders and we don't stop halfway down. Generally, people stop halfway down when they've gone a little bit too heavy. So that is a perfect form. Breathing is paramount as well. Breathe in as you go down and out as you come up. In as you go down and out as you go up. Now, if you just look at her elbows positions as well, her elbow positions are slightly further back. That means that she is engaging a chest. Now, if she was to bring them elbows that way, which a lot of people do and try and press, that's how you end up with shoulder injuries because you haven't got your elbows in the right position. So a good rule of thumb on this, when you're doing it, is just to slightly twist the weights. Can you see how our elbows changing? So just slightly twist them elbows, heads, them wrists. And as she's done there, she's just slightly pointing them that way and she's squeezing. And once you've finished, place the dumbbells on the floor and sit yourself up. And that guys is a decline dumbbell chest press.